Hello, Gamer Nom is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob become pro by using confetti. But before we start, you can show your support by using Starcode Gamer Nom when purchasing your Robux. 5% of the earnings will go to me, and this will really help us on making better videos. Where the actor slam on the dancing forward, that's your slam, that's the top. Wait, Gamer Nom, so how can you use confetti to grind? Obviously, guys. We're gonna grind confettis and head to the party shop. And then we can use those confettis to buy fruits or boosts. So you can only collect 100 confettis per hour. So guys, let's try to buy this spin fruit. And also for this video, we are going to use boosts. Yes, experience boosts to make things faster. Okay, so let's buy this up. There you go. First fruit is the spin fruit. Let's start grinding. So again, we're gonna go back to the starter pirate island so we have the razor wind which is really good for grinding guys for those who don't know and for our target obviously the bandits okay so target level here is level 15 and after that we are heading to the next island the fountain city okay our target the galley pirates and again we're gonna use wall strat you can use your m1 to damage the galley pirate but make sure to end or defeat him using your z skill the razor wind okay we will be unlocking two new skills here. The X skill and the F skill. There you go. Anyway guys, at level 60, we are heading to the next island, the desert. First target, the desert bandits. Same with the bandits guys, kinda easy. Target level is 75. Okay, after that, desert officers. Okay, so we're gonna grind here until level 90 plus. And after that, let's check the party shop located in the middle town. But sadly guys, we don't have enough confettis to buy the party hat. But guys, if you really wanna grind fast, you should buy this one, okay? Gamer Nom, some tips. Yes guys, tip in the first C. Fastest ways to grind here in the middle town. Confettis because there are seven NPCs. This is the first one. The second one, again, take note, you cannot grind confettis on chests in the first C. So again, look for a place where there are lots of NPCs. And this is the place to be. And since there are no good fruits in the party shop, we will continue grinding. So again at this level, Frozen Village is the place to be. And for the target, Snow Bandits. We are going to grind here until level 105 and after that, back to the party shop. And guys, check this out. Light Fruit, yes I want the Light Fruit. This will really make our grinding faster. Plus, we have some more confettis which we will use to buy the boost. Again, this is Logia Elemental, so guys, it's no bandits, very easy to defeat, but we will focus on the Yeti. So again, use your dash left click to damage it, there you go. And we're gonna do Server Hop, plus 2 times EXP, guys, this will be really fast. Our target level here is level 130. There you go, and after that, here are the stats. Go 25 melee defense, blast fruits 346. Next up is the Marine Fortress. And again, Vice Admiral is the target. We're gonna do Wall Strat. So lure him here. Wait for it. There you go. Check that out. We still have 4 minutes of 2 times experience. Go left click, left click, and that's it. Guys, we're gonna do server hub, okay? Oh, we got the coat. There you go. Just keep on defeating him. We will unlock the X skill. Also, by doing server hop, we will conserve our 2 times boost. There you go. Guys, our target level here is level 220. Okay? And after that, we will head to the next island, the prison. For this, we will head to the party shop, guys. Don't worry, party shop. So guys, we will do wall strat with all the bosses. We will unlock the V skill here, Skybeam Barrage, and also the C skill, the Reflection Kick. So guys, again, same strategy with the Chief Warden and the Swan. So there you go. Again, we are going to do server hop here until we reach level 350. Okay, so again, we're gonna head to the party shop after we reach that level. Okay, so let's check the party shop. Guys, this is interesting. We're gonna buy the chopped fruit. I'm gonna tell you why later. This will make things faster, don't worry. Okay, so we bought it plus a boost to make our grinding easier. Okay, what's that? I think it's a smoke fruit user. So guys, let's just run, okay? Let's run. <laughs> we just focus on grinding. <laughs> okay, so next up, Magma Village. 
target military soldiers. This mob has hockey, but we are immune to sword. That's the reason why we bought the chop fruit. There you go, which means we can grind mastery really fast, or we can just stay here to grind, right? But again, we decided to fight the Magma Admiral because we've unlocked all our damaging skills. So here you go, Magma Admiral. Don't worry, the cooldown is really fast. Guys, this is the C skill. This one's really good. This is the X skill. Just take note, you might get damage when you get past the enemy. But all in all, CD is fast, damage is good, okay? So again, target level here is 380. And after that, Underwater City. Target is the Fishman Warriors. Again, no damage because they're using Sword. Okay, there you go. Guys, don't forget to grind confettis for boosts. So let's go and grind confettis. So first, I head to the Fountain City. There are three NPCs here. That's one, two, and three. Okay, next up, the Starter Island, the Pirate. There are five NPCs here. Again, five, one, two, three, four, and five. Guys, I'm not gonna show you the Middle Town. I already showed you that. Jungle has two. Skylands has three. Guys, including the... Uh, okay, not including the Upper Sky. In the Upper Sky, it only has one. There you go. And in the Coliseum, right? There are three NPCs. Oh, I almost forgot. There's still one more island that I haven't visited. The Frozen Village. So it has three NPCs. That's one. That's two. And that's three. Oh, Rufal. Oh, with a bonus bounty hunt. No, no, no. He's attacking us. Let's show them the power of the chop fruit. Boom. Oh, a low level dude. <laughs> anyway, let's head back to the party shop. Mm, okay, guys. I think we're gonna buy the two times boost for faster grinding, right? Yes, let's do it. That's why we are uh, grinding confettis for this one. There you go. Back to grinding. Fishman Warriors. Okay. At 425, Fishman Lord. Guys, wall strat. Very easy. This boss has two forms. The one with the white hair and the cap. Don't worry. As long as you do wall strat, very easy. Target level is 458. Why Gamer Nom? Because on the next island, yes, I am talking about the Skylands. The gods, guards, they're using swords, so we're gonna take advantage of that. There you go, as you can see, no damage inflicted. There you go. So guys, we're gonna grind here until reach level 500. After that, again, party shop. Why? We need to change fruits now. But sadly, there are no good fruits. So guys, we will head to the Whisper and do the Stone Strap. Go. So guys, just head to the stone. He cannot damage you with his bazooka. We are going to keep on beating him until the party shop resets. There you go. So we've reached 565 here. Now we are heading towards the middle town. Hopefully, there's a good fruit. And yes, there is ice fruit, guys. Let's buy that fruit. There you go. Now back to the whisper. So guys, we're gonna use M1 to damage him since we only have one skill. Check this out. Wait for him to attack. There you go. And use your left clicks. Very easy. You can use your Ice Pierce if you want the Z skill. Oh, just repeat and defeat. Oh, that one is good. Repeat and defeat. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do this until we reach level 637. Yes, we skipped the Thunder God and other mobs here. Next up, the Fountain City. Our only target is the Gali Pirates. Why? At this level, guys, check this out. No more damage, elemental scene effect. We unlock our, our, all our skills. Ice Surge, Ice Bird, Glacial Epoch. And guys, we will reach max, oh sorry, max level. I mean 700 here. So do you want me to make a video of level 1 to max using confettis? Comment it in the comment section. And guys, if this video has lots of views, we will do it, okay? So again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. This is GamerNom, and GamerNom out!